Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamualaikum and good day to everyone. So today's topic is parabola. If you look at this figure, this is the shape of a parabola. So what is parabola? A parabola is the locus of a moving point such that its distance from a fixed point F or focus and the fixed line L or directrix are equal. So let's say we have uh, x, uh, y exists here, x exists over here, and this is the shape of our parabola. Okay, and then the point here is called as vertex. Okay, the point above vertex is what we call as focus. And the line below the vertex or below the shape of parabola is the directrix line. So the distance between focus and vertex denoted as P. And the distance between vertex to the directrix, directrix is also denoted as P. So the distance is the same. Okay, the distance between focus to vertex is the same as the distance between vertex to directrix. Okay, there are four standard form for parabola. Okay, open upward, the shape is like this. Okay, open upward and then open downward, the shape is like this. Okay, the third shape is open to the right and the fourth shape is open to the left. Okay, let's look at the standard form for each shape of the parabola. Okay, when open upward, the standard form is x minus h square equal 4py minus k. So, open upward. Focus on the left of the equation. So, 4p is positive and then here we have y. Okay, so open upward. Second shape, downward. So the standard form is x minus h square equal negative 4p y minus k. So when downward, the value here is negative 4p and then we have y on the left. Okay, negative 4py. For the third shape, Open to the right, the standard form is y minus k square equal 4p x minus h. So, open to the right, the value for 4p is positive and then we have x on the right. And the last shape, when the parabola is open to the left, the standard form is y minus k square equal negative 4p x minus h. So the value for 4p is negative and we have x on the right. Okay, when open upward or downward, on the left we have y. Okay, when open to the right or open to the left, on the right we have x. Okay, let's, let's discuss the first example for this topic. Example 40. Given x plus 2 square equal 8. Multiply 3 minus y. Find the vertex, focus and directrix. Hence, sketch the graph showing all the above points. So, to make things easier, okay, for us to identify the vertex, focus and directrix, we can change the given equation into the standard form of parabola. Okay. So, first, put negative y to the front and move 3 to the back and then factor is negative. So, we get x plus 2 square. We know that this parabola is open downward. 
Okay, because on the right, we have negative and Y. Okay, on the right, negative Y, so open downward. Okay, to find the coordinate of vertex, we can compare the equation with the standard form. So, when X plus 2 equals 0, we get X equal negative 2. This is the X coordinate for the vertex. And then take from Y minus K. Here we have Y minus 3. When Y minus 3 equals 0, we get Y equal 3. This is the, co the Y coordinate for vertex. So the vertex is negative 2, 3. Okay, the point for vertex. Next, we want to find the value for P. So again, comparing the two equations, we can take negative 4P equal negative 8. And from there, we get P equal 2. So now we know that the distance from vertex to focus is 2. And distance from vertex to the directory line is also 2. Okay, we can start to sketch the parabola. Okay, so this is the shape facing downward and then plot the vertex at negative 2 3 negative 2 3 and since the distance from vertex to directrix is 2 unit move upward 2 unit so 3 plus 2 we get 5 the line is y equal 5 for the directrix and the distance from vertex to focus is also 2 unit so move downward 2 unit from negative from 3 2 and then 1 therefore the the coordinate for focus is uh Negative 2, 1. Okay. The coordinate for x axis did not change because the changes is along the y axis. Okay. Vertically. The changes is vertically and not horizontally. Right. So, let's try one question. We want to state the condition of the parabola. Okay, condition of the parabola meaning the shape of the parabola. Whether facing upward, downward, to the right or to the left. And then we want to identify the points of vertex and focus. And also the directrix and the value of P. Okay, so the easiest way is... To change the given equation into the standard form of parabola. So from x minus 3 square equal negative 8y. We change it into x minus 3 square equal negative 8y minus 0. So we can compare this to x minus h square equal negative 4py minus k. And now focus on the right side of the equation. Here we have negative 4p, negative 4p and y. So negative 4p and y meaning that our parabola is open downward. Okay, to find the coordinate of vertex. X minus 3 equals 0. We get X equal 3. And then from here, we get straight away Y equal 0. Therefore, the coordinates of vertex is 3, 0. 
and then to determine the distance from vertex to focus and directrix, we, 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 we want to find the value for P. Negative 8 equal to negative 4P. So from there, we get P equal to. Okay, now let's try to sketch the parabola so that we can find the coordinate for focus and also the directrix. Okay, our parabola is facing downward. So, downward. Okay, this is just a sketch, okay? I did not do it uh, accurately. Parabola facing downwards and let's plot the vertex. So, our vertex is over here and the coordinate is 3, 0. Okay, moving to point up. This is the directrix line. So, 3 plus 2, the line is, uh, no, sorry, uh, moving along y-axis, okay, moving vertically. So, the changing coordinate is y-coordinate. So, 0 plus 2, this line is y equal 2. And then, moving downward, 2 units. Okay, this is the focus. So, 0, negative 1, and negative 2. The coordinate for focus is 3, negative 2. Okay, let's try another one. Given y plus 4 square equal 12x minus 36. To change into the standard form. y plus 4 square equal factorize 12 x minus 3. So this one we can compare with y minus k square equal for p x minus h. Okay, focus on the right side of the equation. Here we have positive for p and x. Positive for p and x meaning that our parabola is open to the right. Okay, first let's find the vertex. From y plus 4 equals 0, we get y equal negative 4. And then from x minus 3 equals 0, we get x equal 3. So the coordinate of our vertex is 3, negative 4. Okay, next we want to find p. 4p equal 12, so p equal 12 over 4, and p equal 3. And the distance between vertex to directrix is 3, and distance vertex to focus is also 3. Okay, let's try to sketch the graph. At the parabola and now our parabola is facing to the right okay open to the right this is the vertex okay let's plot our vertex vertex at 3 negative 4 okay and then move 3 point to the right 1 2 3 and this is our focus. Okay, why 3 point? Because P is 3. 
So the distance between vertex to focus is 3 units. So 1, 2, 3 and the changes is horizontally okay, along the x axis. So the changing coordinate is x. So 3, 4, 5, 6. The coordinate of our focus is 6, negative 4. And then let's find the directrix. Move 3 point backward. So 3, 2, 1, 0. And this is our directrix. And since the line is vertical, this line is x equal 0. Okay. Coordinate of our focus, 6, negative 4. And the directrix is x equal 0. So again, when we decide that our parabola is open to the right, okay, sketch the parabola and plot the vertex at 3, negative 4. And then we know that P equal 3. So to find coordinate of focus, move 3 unit to the right. So since we move along the x axis, the changing uh, coordinates will be coordinate x. So 3, 4, 5, 6. The coordinate of focus is 6, negative 4. Okay, to find the directrix, move 3 unit backward. So 3, 2, 1, 0. Okay, this is the directrix and the line is x equal 0. Okay, now let's discuss example 41. Given the equation y equal 8x square, find the standard form of the parabola, the vertex and the equation of directrix. Hence, catch the parabola with the correct vertex and directrix. Okay, from 8x square equal y, leave x square on the left, move it to the right, and then change to standard form. We get x minus 0 square equal 1 over 8y minus 0. Okay, we can compare to this standard form. Okay, focus on the equation on the right side. So, we have positive 4p and y. Okay, positive 4 and y meaning that our parabola is open upward. Okay, and the shape is like this. Okay, the parabola is smiling. Okay, and then... X minus 0, Y minus 0. The coordinates of our vertex is at 0, 0. Okay, to find P, take 1 over 8 equal 4P. And we get P equal 1 over 32. Okay, sketch the parabola and plot the vertex. Okay, vertex is at 0, 0. Okay, 0, 0. To find the focus, okay, the distance here is 1 over 3 over 2. Okay, the, change, the changing coordinate is coordinate y. So for focus, x is still 0, y is 1 over 3 over 1 over 32. Okay, and then for the focus, uh, for the directrix, okay, we move 1 over 32 unit. Okay. Horizontal line. And horizontal line is y equal 1 over negative 1 over 32. Okay. Because we move downward from 0. Okay. Another example. This one is example 42. Sketch the graph of a parabola. 2y square plus 8y minus 16x minus 8 equals 0. Hence, state the vertex, focus and the directrix. Okay, first, we divide all the equation. We divide the whole equation by 2. Why? Because we want the coefficient for y square to be 1. So, divide everything by 2. We get y square plus 4y minus 8x. Minus 4 equal 0. 
and then over here we apply uh, completing the square okay completing the square for y variable okay after a few steps finally we get the standard form of parabola y plus 2 square equal 8 x plus 1 so this equation is comparable to y minus k square equal 4 p x minus h so on the right we have positive for p and x positive x so our uh, parabola is open to the right so like this open to the right okay, and then from the equation we can get the uh, coordinates of vertex x plus 1 so x equal negative 1 y plus 2 so y equal negative 2 the coordinates of our vertex is negative 1 negative 2 okay to find p or the distance between vertex to focus and vertex to directrix we take 4p equal 8 and we get p equal 2 Okay, sketch the parabola, open to the right, and plot our vertex. So, our vertex is at negative 1, negative 2. Move two point to the right to find focus. So, negative 1, uh, 0, and 1. The changing coordinate is coordinate x because we move horizontally. Okay, vertex negative 1, negative 2, so focus 1, negative 2. And then move 2 units backward to find the directrix. From negative 1, negative 2 and negative 3. So this is the directrix and the equation is x equal negative 3, okay, for this vertical line. Okay, let's try this question. We want to find the standard form for the equation of the following clinics. Hence, identify and sketch by indicating the vertex, focus and directrix. So first, we would like to uh, try to transform this given equation into the standard form of parabola. Okay, in order to do that, we will try, uh, we will apply completing the square method. So we will apply completing the square method for x variable and take note that our b here is negative 4. So, x square minus 4x plus negative 4 over 2 square minus negative 4 over 2 square minus 4y equal 0. Okay, and then we simplify. We take x square and negative 4 over 2. So, x minus 2 square equal bring 4y to the right 4y negative 4 over 2 is negative 2 negative 2 square is 4 okay. bring negative 4 to the right plus 4 and as for the last step we can factorize 4 ok now this is already in the standard form of parabola so we can compare this equation to x minus h square equal 4p y minus k. And from there, we can get the coordinate of vertex. And x minus 2 equals 0, x equal 2. y plus 1 equals 0, y equal negative 1. So, our vertex is at 2, negative 1. Okay, to find P 
for p equal 4, p equal 1. And next, we want to find the coordinates of focus and equation for our directrix. Oh, the direction of our parabola. Okay, focus on the right. Positive 4 and y. Okay, we have positive 4p and y. Meaning that our parabola is open upward. Okay, let's try to sketch the parabola. The shape is smiling and this is our vertex. Our vertex is at 2, negative 1. And now, we will move vertically. Okay, we will move vertically meaning that the changing coordinates will be coordinate y. And the distance is only one point. Okay, move one point upward. This is our focus. The coordinate for our focus, okay, because we only move one point, we start at negative one, move one point upward, and the coordinate is to zero. Okay. For directrix, move one point downwards, and this is the directrix line. Horizontal, y equal, okay, starting from negative 1, move 1 unit downward, so this is y equal negative 2. Example 43. Find the equation of a parabola which is symmetric about the x-axis and has its vertex at the origin and passes through 4-2. Okay, start by sketching the graph to get some description. Okay, so here we have y-axis and x-axis. Our vertex is at near here at 0, 0. Okay, this is the coordinates of our vertex and the parabola will pass through this point for two. So by referring to the by referring to the vertex and point for two, the graph is either opens upward. So logically, some other okay open upward. Okay, lalu vertex and point for two, or opens to the right. Okay, opens to the right. So like this. Okay, there are two possibility of the shape of the parabola. Open upward or open to the right. Since the parabola is symmetric about the x-axis, so it is open to the right. So, another information given, the graph must be symmetric to the x-axis. So, from there we can conclude that the shape of the parabola is open to the right. So, something like this. Okay. It passes through point 0.42 and then vertex at 0, 0. So, standard form for parabola open to the right is y minus k square equal 4px minus h. Okay, look on the right, positive 4p and x. So, to the right. Substitute vertex at 0, 0. So, we get y square equal 4px and then substitute point for 2 to get uh, p. Okay, substitute 2 at y and substitute 4 at x. From there, we get p equal 1 over 4. Substitute back okay, p to this equation and then finally, we get y square equal x. Okay, that is our equation of parabola. Okay, let's try this question. Write the equation of the parabola with the given vertex at 3 over to 1 and passes through point 2, 0 and 6, 4. Hence, identify and sketch by indicating the vertex, focus and directrix. So, we are given the vertex and another two points. 
Okay, let's try to plot the points. Okay, starting from our vertex. Okay, our vertex is at 3 over 2, 1. One point is at 3 over 2 is about 1.5. So, another point is 2, 0. 2, 0, 1 point below to the right. Okay, this is the point 2, 0. And then we have another point at 6, 4. So, 6, 4, 6, 4 over here. 6, 4. Okay, based on the point, we can try to determine the shape of the parabola. So, most probably, our parabola is facing to the right. Okay, if we try to connect the point and V as the vertex. Okay, so this is the, uh, probably the, the most possible shape of our parabola based on the plotted points. So our parabola, our parabola is facing to the right. Okay, open to the right. Okay, the standard form of parabola which open to the right is y minus k square equal 4p x minus h. Okay. Positive for P and X. Positive for P, X, open to the right. If negative for P and X, open to the left. Positive for P and Y, open upward. Negative for P and Y, open downward. Okay, we know the coordinates of vertex. We can substitute into H and K. Y minus 1 square equal for p x minus 3 over 2. Okay, this is the equation when we substitute vertex. 3 over 2 is h and 1 is k. Okay, then we want to find p. To find p, you can choose to substitute 6, 4 or 2, 0 into the equation. Okay, I choose to substitute 2, 0. To find P. 0 minus 1 square equal for P 2 minus 3 over 2. Negative 1 square is 1 for P. 2 minus 3 over 2 is 1 over 2. And from here we get P equal 1 over 2. Okay, to find the focus. Move 1 over 2 unit to the front, uh, to the right. So the changing, the changing coordinates will be coordinate X because we move horizontally. 3 over 2 plus 1 over 2 because the distance is 1 over 2 unit. Okay, here is P. 3 over 2 plus 1 over 2 is 2. So, the coordinate for focus is 2, 1. And then, move backward 1 over 2 unit. Okay, this is P. This is also P. And we get the directrix. So, move backward 3 over 2 minus 1 over 2. This line is x equal 1. So from here we get focus at 2, 1. And directrix at x equal 1. Okay, example 44. Find the standard form of the parabola with vertex at negative 2, 3 and focus 0, 3. State the directrix. Okay, so this time we are given the vertex 
and focus. So we will try to sketch the graph by first plotting the given points. Okay, this is our vertex. Our vertex at negative 2, 3. And then our focus here at 0, 3. So we can see that the changing coordinates is coordinate x. And from negative 2 to 0, the unit is 2. Okay, then we know that P equal 2. Okay, from negative 2 to 0. So P equal 2. And then move 2 backward and we get the line for directrix. So negative Negative 2 minus 2, this line is x equal negative 4. Okay, since the focus is located inside the curve, so the graph is open to the right. The distance from vertex to focus is 2 units, p equal 2. So the distance from vertex to the directrix is also 2 units. Okay, the standard form for parabola open to the right. And then we can substitute the vertex. And substitute P. Finally, we get Y equal 3 square equal 8X plus 2. And the directrix is at X equal negative 4. Okay, let's try this question. We want to find an equation of the parabola with vertex at 5, 3 and focus at 4, 3. So this question is similar to the previous example that we just discussed. We are given the coordinates for vertex and focus. Hence, identify and sketch by indicating the vertex, focus and directrix. Okay, let's try to plot the uh, points given. Okay, first we have 5, 3. Let's say this is 5, 3 and this is our vertex. Our vertex at 5, 3. And then our focus is at 4, 3. So focus to the left. Focus at 4, 3. So the distance here is P. Okay. 4 to 5. So P equal 1. Meaning that our parabola is open to the left. Okay, and then move one point backward. Here also P equal 1. This is our directrix. Okay, 5 plus 1 at X equal 6. Okay, for parabola open to the left, the standard form is Y minus K square equal negative 4P X minus H. So, negative for P, X. Meaning that our parabola is open to the left. Okay, let's substitute our vertex and P. Vertex is given at 5, 3. So, 5 is H and 3 is K. And then our P is 1. From there we get Y minus 3 square equal negative 4X minus 5. Okay, that is the equation of the parabola. And the directrix. Okay, the directrix is at X equal 6. Okay, let's try one more question. Find an equation of the parabola with vertex at 4, negative 1 and directrix at y equal negative 1 over 2. So, previous question, we are given the coordinates for vertex and focus but for this particular question, we are given the coordinates of vertex and equation of directrix. Hence, identify and sketch by indicating the vertex Focus and directrix. Okay, first let's try to plot the given information. Okay, 
starting from the vertex. Okay, let's say this is our vertex. Our vertex at 4, negative 1. 4, negative 1. And then, y equal 1 over 2 is the uh, directrix. So, from 4, negative 1. This is y equal 1 over 2. So, the difference between negative 1 and 1 over 2 is P. Negative 1, 1 over 2 minus negative 1. So, the distance is 3 over 2. So, P equal 3 over 2. And then move to find focus. Here the distance is also 3 over 2. And because we move vertically, okay, vertically, the changing coordinates will be coordinate y. So moving downward by 3 over 2 unit, negative 1 minus 3 over 2. And we get negative 5 over 2. That will be the coordinate of our focus. 4, negative 5 over 2. And our parabola is facing downward. Okay. Open, downward. The standard form. X minus H square equal negative 4P, Y minus K. Let's substitute our parabola, you eh, know, our vertex. Uh, given 4, negative 1, this is H, this is K. And then our P, okay, we find P earlier, P equal 3 over 2. Okay, the distance between vertex and directrix. So, 1 over 2 minus negative 1, we get 3 over 2. And then, negative 1 minus 3 over 2, we get negative 5 over 2. Okay, for our focus. Okay, let's substitute. Okay, the standard form is x minus 4 square equal negative 6 y plus 1. And this is the standard form. If we want to continue to find the equation of the parabola, okay, we can expand x minus 4. We should get x square minus 8x plus 16 and then expand the right equation. Negative 6y minus 6. Move equation on the right to the left and rearrange. We shall get x square minus 8x plus 6y plus 16 minus 6. So plus 10. Oh sorry. Plus 16. Okay, minus 6. Move to the left. Okay, tulis dulu lah. So, x square minus 8x plus 6y plus 22 equals 0. Okay, and this is the equation of parabola. Okay, I hope you can see the difference. This is the standard form. And this is the equation of parabola. Yeah.